perfect shot is rare indeed. Banging off a man, goal line, touchdown Barber. So many elements have to be just right. Lost his helmet, keeps running, without a hat, 15 to the 10 to the 6. Don't take a man's hat. Position, exposure, luck. To the 10, 5, it's wide open, touchdown Romo. It takes patience, practice, persistence to capture the perfect picture. Intercepted at the 50, Newman can take this one in. Touchdown, Terrence Newman. Goals are unclear until the focus is shot. Down the post hole at the 10 all along to the crossbar where he spikes it over the top. Images of today have been influenced by pictures of the past. Pearson goes in for the touchdown, and Pearson throws the ball over the scoreboard. Those who have come before left indelible images inspired us and showed us what we can become. How about this, devil? Yeah! The perfect shot is rare indeed. One second you think you've got it, the next it's gone in a flash. The beat. It drives, it moves us, stirs the soul, the beat. Primitive, yet complex. Simple, yet spiritual. From a single musician to a finely tuned band, the beat is the lifeblood of music. For the Dallas Cowboys, 2009 saw 53 hearts come together to beat as one. Oh, we gotta be tough. The tone of 2009, team. Touchdown, Patrick Creek. The tempo, Allegro. Touchdown, 49 yards. The melody, magical. Music can be a salvation. Austin made the play! Austin saved the day! Its conductor orchestrated a verse never heard. Back-to-back -back shutouts for the first time in the history of the franchise. All phases must move in harmony toward a common goal. The Dallas Cowboys won the NFC East today. A crescendo at season's end. Thrown in the end zone, caught by John Phillips. Touchdown to Shard. Choice. Austin five, Austin goal line. Say goodnight. 73 yards. The playoff drought is over. Yes, the beat can be a lot of things. But most importantly, the beat must go on. Cowboys, Redskins. <laughs> it has been a heated clash since the days of the old cattle drives in the West. A battle waged on the plains and prairies. In modern times, the rivalry has moved to the east. Oh, hand off and Ed Jones snuffs it. The battlefield, the gridiron. The calls, the same. Territorial rights. Tony Hill, Cowboys, Redskins. These two sides still agree to disagree. There's a big fight. Oh, flags everywhere. They're going to throw Spellman out of this game. It's over. It's all over. It's a personal foul. Blow to the face. Oh, my goodness. The Cowboys are riding high on top of the division. <laughs> the Redskins are desperate to get back in the fight. The table is set. All signs point to another classic conflict. History, passion, and pride, they're all on the line. It's a high noon tussle. It's Cowboys, Redskins, again. The pure promise of a newly sparked candle can be deceiving. Oh, it's to the five! Touchdown! Ocho Uno! The 
dancing flame demands our attention. The Cowboys report to training camp with high expectations. It brings hope from despair. An interception is going to end the Dallas Cowboys season. And light to darkness. Here comes Ware for his weekly sack. But sometimes the light reveals things we'd rather not see. They rush the punt, they block the punt. The Cardinals pick it up and walk it in. Touchdown, game over. Sometimes the light itself is fragile. Uh oh, he's injured. The Cowboys have a man down on the field. And there's an injured Cowboy. They cannot afford to lose any more players. Candles indeed are a burning example that the whole is more than the sum of its parts. I don't know how much of what any of us have read or heard is true. Wax, wick, and fire, whose very genesis stems from friction, attrition, and erosion. He is sacked again by Jay Rentlin. Holy cow, what a defensive effort this is. That's a price of admission run after catch. But yet there still is that flame. A ridiculous throw by Tony Romo. A beacon in the darkness. And DeMarcus Ware has it. Providing a glimmer of hope, fragile though it may be. The pure promise of a newly sparked candle can be deceiving. 